My job differs very much from your average farm manager's role. We're not here for economic success in terms of farming. We're here to answer some of those challenging questions. So the main difference is the minutiae of detail we have to get into and we have to remember we're here primarily to capture data and not to produce agricultural produce. My name's Bruce Griffith. I'm the farm manager, the research farm manager here at Rothamsted Northwick. So my job encompasses looking after the operational side of the farm and a lot of the practical science that goes on on the farm as well. So all the technicians, all the guys out in the field collecting all the, all the data on a daily basis. Here at Northwick, we're the grassland and sustainable livestock side of Rothamsted research. The farm platform project specifically has been here for about 10 years now. We started in around 2011. We're a huge data gathering exercise looking at some different farming systems, how we can farm sustainably, how we can produce nutrients for human consumption against the backdrop of climate change and against the backdrop of an increasing world population. On a day-to-day -day basis, the main challenges are thinking about how we're going to achieve that practical farming but capture that data in, in very high resolution. So the fact we're a long-term monitoring experiment, we aim to be here over the long term gathering data for many years, plus the fact we're looking at systems in their totality rather than focusing on a small element as you might do in a, in a classical field experiment. Um, that really allows us to look at, look at things holistically and look at some of the trade-offs. So we may be improving things in one respect, in one area, but causing more problems in another area. So by gathering all that data and feeding it into the modeling community and allowing them to tease out some of these questions and answers, yeah, really helps us drive things forward in a way that your classic field experiment can't. Obviously, Livestock production has a very poor reputation these days in terms of its environmental footprint. So we're really trying to gather some real life data and get some real numbers behind what are the real environmental consequences of livestock production and what are the environmental consequences of trying to do something else as well. What else could we do with these landscapes if we weren't farming them with livestock? So this experiment is unique in the UK on its scale, but we are tied in with similar systems around the world and similar projects around the world. We're trying to do similar things, but in different farming systems and making that data available via our community to the researchers and modelers around the world. We're not going to save the world here on our own, but we feed a huge amount of information into that debate and link up with other researchers around the world. And we're a key part of the jigsaw in terms of the data that can be gathered on, on livestock, uh, livestock farming systems. So we're open to business. We try and encourage uh, researchers from elsewhere to come and work on the farm platform. We're also always open to visitors. We love getting farmer groups around, talking about what we're doing, uh, youngsters around, uh, school groups, uh, really looking at some of the sustainability issues around agriculture um, and perhaps inspiring them for, the, for their futures as well.